I think he should go see a doctor. Morphle, morph into an ambulance. Thank you very much for bringing Troy to the hospital, Mila and Morphle. When I grow up, I want to be a doctor too. That way, I can help people get better, just like you. That's very nice, Mila, but I will tell you a secret. It's not just people that I help. I am also the doctor that treats all the mythological creatures that live in and around this city. It would be a great help if I could use this amazing ambulance to visit my next mythological patients. Yeah, of course! Our first stop is Starfish Island. Our next patient is the mountain giant. Look! That's him! Wow! Let's try again, Morphle. ever reach the mountain giant. I have an idea. Morphle, add a jet engine to the ambulance. Thank you so much. Morphle was a great... Oh, no! It looks like Morphle the ambulance caught the flu from one of our patients. Poor Morphle. Please help Morphle get better, Doctor. I'll give Morphle some medicine. But the rest is up to you, Mila. Because the most important thing Morphle needs now is love and care. This healthy soup, Morphle. Once upon a time, there was a little red ambulance, and it caught the flu, and it was very sick. But the little red ambulance also had a friend. We'll have 
to be very careful with this. This is my big box of scary monsters. of my scary monsters escaped. I'm on my way. I don't think so. I think you're a fluffy sweetheart. It's not okay to scare people, monster. The monsters from the Magic Pet Store are scaring everyone, but Morpho is not a real monster. <laughs> ah, the real monsters! Stop scaring everyone, monsters! <laughs> Scare me like that! <laughs> hey, the monsters are scared of Morpho. You're a monster scaring monster. You don't have to be scared of Morpho. He's a friend of mine, and he's actually quite sweet and fluffy. Here, you can pet him. You see? But it doesn't feel good to be scared. Now it does it, monsters. You shouldn't scare other people either. Monsters should help people to not be afraid of scary things. Yeah, just like I helped you guys to not be scared of Morpho. I'm scared of the doctor. The monster is not scared of the doctor. You don't have to be scared either. to ride a bike. The monster will help you to not be scared. <laughs> Look, Morpho, you 
should morph into a floaty shark too, so we can play with our friends. No, wait! Morpho should morph into a real pet shark. Morpho, morph into a real pet shark. A big and scary one. Is Morpho mean now? He looks so mean and scary. No, Morpho is a super friendly shark. Right, Morpho? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Morpho the friendly shark. People, 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 can I please have your attention? You should never, ever, ever throw garbage on the beach. For example, there's garbage floating in the sea right there. This is bad for all the cute little fishes. Oh no! It's a shark! You all need to hide! But Mr. Lifeguard, this shark is a friendly shark. No, 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 no. I don't believe it. Sharks are never friendly. Help! Help! My poor little jitterbug has been swept out to sea. Look, Morpho. Jitterbug the dog is in trouble. Somebody has to save it. Morpho, save. Oh, no. That shark wants to eat that little dog. No, no. He doesn't. He wants to save the doggy. Don't be silly, little girl. It's hero time! Shark, the little kids were right. You are a friendly shark. He is. It's my pet, Morpho. Do you want to take a ride on his back? Stop it. That's mean. No, we're not gonna stop. Because we are pirates and we do mean things all the time. Hey, just look at those mean pirates. You know, Morphle, we all know you're a friendly shark now. But those mean pirates don't know you're friendly. <laughs> look, look, look! Ah! Now, let's help this little fella rebuild his sand castles. Ew! 
the garbage should have been collected today, but the garbage truck didn't show up. Morpho could become a garbage truck. Great! So, here's the garbage, Morpho. Okay, Morpho, let's pick up all the trash. And don't forget to find out the mystery of why the garbage truck didn't show up. Okay. Wow, it's a living garbage truck. I'm broken. My inventor made me to do important calculations with numbers and stuff. But my screen just shows the wrong things. Wow! That's so special! More for like, more for like! <laughs> Sun! That's really cool! You're not garbage! Do you want to be our friend? I would love to be your friend. Look! Somebody threw away an old baby carriage and some other stuff. Throw them in the garbage truck, Morpho. No, don't. That garbage can be reused, just like me. to build. A doggy. Doggy. I love garbage. Okay, more for the garbage truck. Now let's bring all the garbage to the garbage dump. This is the garbage dump. The gate is closed. We can't go in. Where is the garbage man? Garbage man, where are you? Hmm, it's a mystery. Bark, bark. Hey, the robot doggy smells something. I think the robot doggy has found the trace of the garbage man. Let's follow it. Hey, garbage man! Why are you here? Why are you not picking up the garbage? I don't want to be a garbage man anymore, so I got myself a new job. Here, at the flower store. Flowers smell so good. Much better than garbage. Yuck! I really don't like garbage. You don't? I love garbage. Robot new garbage man! I could build so many cool things out of all this garbage. I'll get started right away. Wow! That's 
It's a beautiful house. We'll have lots of fun living here. Won't we, Dougie? Bark, bark, bark. It's time for us to go home now. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. to be when I grow up? Uh, a panda bear! <laughs> no, silly! I want to be a bus driver! Oh, a bus driver! Morpho! Morph into a big red bus! Hello there. To the police station, please. Yes, sir. Can I please see our ticket? Oh, hi, Mila. I'm going to my laboratory. Okay. This naughty monkey and myself are heading to the zoo. Sure. I have to go to my auntie, the witch. She lives in a little house up on the highest mountain outside the city. Oh, your aunt is a witch? Yeah, and I'm a witch too. My auntie sent me a magic wand for my birthday. I'm going to visit her so she can teach me how to use it. The wand never works the way I want it to. Hmm. That sounds important. We should bring you to your destination first. Okay, Mr. Police Officer. Morpho, to the big mountain outside of the city. Okay, I will climb up the mountain myself. Great, Morpho! This is where we drop off Zookeeper Kenneth and the monkey. Hey, what's this? The little witch girl left her magic wand behind. Uh-oh, we should bring it back to her. Hey, monkey, don't do that! Huh? Where are we? It appears that the magic wand has sent us to the North Pole! Code! <laughs> I, uh, I want to go, go back. It's w w way too c cold here. Send us back to our city, Zookeeper Kenneth. Okay, Magic Wand. Back to the city. sure this is the Congo Rainforest. Why did you zap us here, Zookeeper Kenneth? I didn't do it on purpose. The little witch girl was right. This magic wand is difficult to use. I'll try one more time. Magic wand, bring us back home. I don't think we should use the magic wand anymore. 
We should bring it back to the little witch girl and her aunt as quickly as possible. Morpho, morph into a flying bus. Now let's fly to the mountain top where the witch lives. We brought you your magic wand. We tried to use it, but it didn't work the way we wanted it to. Well, I know how to use it very well. The trick is you need to make your magic spell rhyme. Where do you need to go, ma'am? To my laboratory. Pay close attention, my student. Magic wand, please do something for me. And bring this lady to her laboratory. The next thing I want my little wand to do is to bring these two fellows to the zoo. And this policeman is also in the wrong location. Please, Wand, bring him to the police station. Now you try. Okay. It's getting late, so Magic Wand, please go ahead and bring my new friends to their bed. Okay, Morphle, we are moving with all our animals from this old zoo to our brand new zoo, all the way across town. Okie dokie, Zookeeper Kenneth. I will bring all of these animals if you bring the biggest of all. The blue whale. But even though they're big, they're not scary. All they eat is plankton. And they love plankton. Oh, and there's one more thing. You have to be very careful of the animal thief. The animal thief loves stealing animals. Okay. We will be very careful. getting away. Na, 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 na. We will bring you to the other side, officer. Na, 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 na. Da, 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 da. You've 
been very bad, animal thief. You cannot just go around and steal animals. You are going to jail. Now let's bring the animals to the new zoo. Huh. Let's go, Morpho. <laughs> Now we won't be able to get it out. That plant is way too prickly. Morpho! Morph into a robot! Aren't you scared? Morpho the robot, no scared of anything! Yay! Hey! I saw what your robot just did. My dog went into a dark and scary cave, and I need help getting it out. It went in here, but that cave is so scary. My the robot, not scared of anything. We could use some light in here. There it is! <laughs> Wow, you saved my daughter's doggy from that scary cave. You are truly afraid of nothing. For saving the mayor's little pet doggy dog, you, Morpho the Robot, get this award for being afraid of nothing and a great doggy dog hero. Hello, Mila and Morpho. I am a scientist. Wow, Morpho. It's a real life scientist. Morpho, we need your help. You see, our space satellite broke. Okay, Morpho the robot. You will need all these spare parts to fix the satellite. Morpho, you can't take me with you this time. You have to take all these tools along instead. Don't worry, Morpho. We will keep a close eye on you from my laboratory. Morpho the robot, not scared of anything. Very good, Morpho. Up you go. Morpho made it to space. First, fly to the moon. Yay! Great! Morpho made it to the moon. Okay, Morpho. Now wait here for the satellite to pass by. Morpho, there's the satellite. You can go fix it. No, Morpho the robot, scared. Oh, poor Morpho. He's scared. Morpho, I thought you weren't scared of anything. M Morpho, scared without Mila. 
Robot Morpho is scared to be alone. Mila, I guess you have to go up in space anyway. Morphle the robot, I am blown away. Just blown away. You did not just save a doggy dog, you also repaired an important satellite in space. You are truly not scared of anything. Morphle the robot, no scared of anything, only Mila and with Morphle. Sire. Morpho! Morph into a tow truck! Great! Okay, Morpho, to the garage. Hello there, we have a flat tire. Whoa, it's a living tow truck. That's amazing. It's called Morpho. If I could use your living tow truck for the day, I'll fix your tire for free. The first client we need to help is the ice cream man. His ice cream truck broke down. Okay, hook him up, Marvel. I'll have his ice cream truck fixed in no time. Thank you, a Morpho the tow truck. Here, have uh, some ice cream. Ice cream! The next tow job is going to be a little bit more challenging. Wow! That truck is so big! Morpho! Morph into a giant tow truck! Well, have I ever... Okay, Morpho! Bring this truck 
back to the garage. Wait, Morpho! I forgot to close the truck properly! Morpho, wait! La 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 la! Oh no! Cream truck. Morpho loves ice cream. Ice cream man, we need your help. If Morpho sees the ice cream truck, he will stop for sure. Here you go, Morphle. For every car you bring back, I'll buy you an ice cream. I found those eggs with my time machine. They were just laying there in the past with no parents to take care of them. Morpho, morph into a triceratops. Dinosaurs don't exist anymore. But with this special time machine, we can find different dinosaurs from millions of years ago and zap them right into our time so we can study them. But we don't need this one here right now. Let's send him home. Oh no! Mila, use the time machine to zap me back into our time! I'll try! Yes! Great! Now zap me! Oops! Oh no! Try again! Mila, you and 
Morphle have to go find my friend, Professor Tsong. She's a scientist too. She will be able to fix the time machine. Okay. Watch out, Morphle. That's a T-Rex. T-Rex no eat babies. Let's go, Morphle. We have to find Professor Tsong. Come, Morphle. This way. The dinosaurs are walking all through the city. Watch out, Morphle! It's the T-Rex! T-Rex no eat babies! This is where Professor Tsong lives! Professor Tsong! Mila, Morphle, what's going on? Please help us fix this time machine! We need to zap the T-Rex back into its own time. Oh no! The T-Rex is almost here! Okay, all done. Quick, Morphle, zap him! <laughs> They fixed the time machine! Now let's send the other dinosaurs back too! Thank you so much for saving me, Mila Morphle. I've talked about it with Professor Tsong, and maybe it's best if we send the Triceratops babies back to their time too. But you said the eggs didn't have a mommy or daddy to protect them. Uh, yeah, but... Morphle, no send back babies. But we can't keep them, Morphle. Mommy and daddy only allow me one pet. And I already have you! Don't worry, Morpho! I know how we can find a good home for them! Morpho! Morph into a dump truck! Great! Now we can take all these stones with us to the building site. Okay, Marvel, let's go! Let's go! La 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 We need all these rocks to build houses. Okay, Morpho, drop them here. Okie dokie. Using a hammer, we smash the rocks in the right shape to build houses with. Smash! 
And this is where we build the houses. We lay the stones on top of each other and build houses. It's lunchtime. You really love houses, don't you, Uncle Lawrence? Yes, I do. Because houses are the most important things in our lives. What was that? Look, look! Something here is eating its way through the houses. Oh! What could it be? Look! <laughs> wow! It's a stone-eating monster! S stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You cannot just go around and eat people's houses! Houses are the most important things in our lives, and you cannot just take them away from people. But Uncle Lawrence, I think we took the monster's house away first. Huh? The stone-eating monster came out of Morpho the dump truck. He must have lived in the pile of rocks. I is that true, stone-eating monster? Did we take away your house? Uh -huh. Well, that's terrible. We're going to bring your home back to where we found it. Okay, Morpho, let's give the monster his home back. Yeah. That's okay, Mila. We'll find rocks somewhere else. I think he wants to show us something. Follow, follow. Huh? I think he means he could use these rocks. Yeah, w with a lot of hard work, I could turn those rocks into houses. That looks amazing, stone-eating monster. Now for the finishing touches. Wow, Uncle Lawrence and stone-eating monster. These houses are great. We're the lake house. Yeah, I say we're a great team, stone-eating monster. We should work together from now on. <laughs> 